What are the x and y components of a velocity of 100 meters per second at 30 degrees above the horizon? So that's the question over here. In this question, we are given the initial velocity, v0, which is equal to 100 meters per second, marked in red, and the theta, which is 30 degrees, marked in green. To solve the x component, to solve the x component based on trig ratios, we can see that the v naught x is v naught cos theta right over here, which is equal to 100 meters per second times cos of 30 degrees, which equals 86.6 meters per second. Also, to solve the y component, so to find the v naught y, um, we can see that v naught y is equal to v naught sine theta which is equal to 100 meters per second times sine of 30 degrees equals 50 meters per second in the y direction. The second example over here has the exact same solution. The question asks, what are the x and y components of a velocity of a football kicked at 50 meters per second on an angle of 45 degrees above the field? That's our question over here. Uh, once again, we take the v naught, so we're given the v naught, which is 50 meters per second, and the theta, which is 45 degrees, and um, we take the v naught x as v naught of cos theta over here, which is 50 meters per second times cos of 45 degrees, which is equal to 35.4 meters per second. Then we have the y component, which is v naught sine theta again, which is 50 meters per second times the sine of 45 degrees, which is equal to 35.4 meters per second. The x and y components both happen to equal 35.4 meters per second for this example because the cos of 45 degrees and the sine of 45 degrees are both the same number.